Hello guys, here we go again. That's the new project car, which is the S5. It's a 3 liter TFSI, but don't worry, the A6 is still in the family. So the first modification, it's swapped the original grill to the RS style grill. So in this video, I show you how to do that. So the first step is we need to remove the whole bumper. The screws location is over there, plus especially behind that cover. Uh, we need to remove that plastic piece as well and do the other side. And after that, just pop it up. So this is the hidden bolt. If you see on the top, that little one, just not in focus. Try to be closer. So that T30, it's holding your bumper behind that cover. So we need to remove that with a little bit of extension. There's also, you have a plastic, uh, like a clips, which is in a corner. So if you remove that things too, after that, uh, just going on a engine bay and remove the others on top and you can pop it out your bumper. So this plastic is easy to pop it out, but before you do that, you don't want to break the bonnet opener. So easy to remove it. Just push it down a far a bit and then pop it out. After that, make sure you're not gonna damage anything. And just sliding out in a corner. Let's do the inside as well, and then out. It's so easy. Oh, I forget to tell you, but uh, we have a couple of T30s underneath as well, which needs to be removed before you pop it up your bumper. So do that and then remove your bumper. Right, we done, all bolts is removed and clips as well, so ready to pop it out. If you are alone and you don't want to scratch your bumper, best way to do that, just make some foam in it or something like that. And gently come in, in the corner, pop it out, and here it is, so easy. After that, just going through the other side and do the same thing, lift it up a bit, pop it out and sliding into the foam. Of course, if you have a headlight washer or a lane assistant, you need to unplug that cable and your bumper now is free. So that's gonna be awkward and really nightmare, the bottom one. But you need to remove those bolts all around and the clips and also the front sensors. And as you can see in it, I try to protect my bumper as much as possible by using the cardboard and the foam. So it's optional. an extra tip for you because you want to be your best looking so paint your 
uh, crash bar because behind the grill if you didn't paint it it looks like so silly the silver bar it's behind that grill you know it's not my taste really and off topic because a plan for me to tinting my headlights which is now much more easier because the bumper is not in it so let me do that as well Guys, look at that! Oh, it's so amazing! But the final result is, if I close the bonnet, it looks like much more aggressive than before. Especially with the smoky thin thing foils on the headlights. <laughs> 